My young friend slept under wadded newspapers and their lies underground in the BART station, or near a dark dune by the heaving ocean's eye. In the rains or dry, I wept over his dreaming limbs. Someone reaches into his pocket. Someone holds the cup. Gratitude balances the black well of compassion. This overwhelming dialectic, what is new and arising, shooting flames through the broken places. The Senate voted to cut food stamps. Why? Written on a cardboard sign. The rich pay no tax. I did pay. Now I beg. Anything helps. Love enough for my spanging cup overflowing or empty. Spanging equals spare changing. The kids call it. Help make, help make this skinny kid a fat one. I know the politic of its young cheek that rises over the horizon with roses of cracking dawn in February. When hiding from the cold and holding on to fugitive bedding and chatting, organizing late online is the order of this raw evening. When will we be warm again? Iraq vet, need food for my wife, my dog, and me. Light of day stretched on the sidewalk, was rousted up early, and got on his business of revolution early, wakened by the crack apart of its dawning. For some reason, the cops didn't bother us in the park last night. We need to fall off a tower of Z's into some real sleep. We need ID to get a room at the Henry Hotel. <laughs> they picked up their gear, she with her guitar, he with his African drum, shouldered it, and went off to seek some stolen sleep again, my young friends. 50 bucks a night for all the bed bugs that can bite you is the deal here in St. Francis City. Sleep in the shadow of an endless red cop. Passed out down in the station, dreaming of sleep. Pages folded and scattered to the wind, unflagging manifestos of the homeless young. Gonna need another revolution just to get some peace and justice and a little sleep. <laughs>